Legalize it. Uh, uh, uh. Don't criticize it. Uh. Legalize it. What are you talking about, man? Don't criticize it. You're talking about freedom. Yes. Legalize it. What's up? What's up? What's up? Don't criticize it. What's going on, everybody? Here's a video from uh, Anthony X, uh, Panama City captain, I believe. Uh, there's a commercial building here. There's a, a, a guy staying there with permission from the owners. Um, he's a veteran. Um, they don't have a warrant. Um, they saw a car on the outside, and, you know, they use cars to create narratives of suspicion. They ran the plates on the car, came back to the address right there. That wasn't good enough for them, so they walked past multiple no trespassing signs and walked right into this guy's house. Link in the description if you don't want to hear me talking. Gonna be pausing this video. Captain and his homeboy just walk in, wake this dude up, start barking at him to put up his dog and turn on the TV, tell him what to do in his house with no warrant, and wait till you hear a stupid justification. So, subscribe to Anthony X, and here we go. Put him in that closet. Who the F are you? Why are you in here? The, the, the attitude that they can just do whatever they feel like, like sovereigns, which is exactly how they act. They act like they're sovereign from the law. He's in here with no warrant. Doesn't matter if it's a commercial building, which is the excuse he's going to use. Turn the TV down and work on some ID. Why are you in my house? Why are you in my house? Why are you on the premises? What? Who told you you could walk in, breach any doorway, come onto the property at all? What reason do you have to be there? But he acts like he, not only he should, should he be there, like it's his place, he owns it, and that he could defend it with force, as you're about to see. Wakes this veteran up out of his sleep. How dare you engage in your freedoms in your own house, smart ass? Come over here and I'll have to use violence against you and push you down and degrade you by pushing your head. Ready? Here we go. It's definitely not your house, pig. You definitely don't have jurisdiction in there. You don't have any authority to be inside of there. No one called you from there. If if it's anyone's house out of the two of you, it's the guy you just used violence against and put on the ground. If it's anyone's house, it's his. You idiot. You imbecile. I guess this is Panama City, Florida. I don't know if it's PD or sheriff or what. You mean you want me to investigate this? 
Before I just enter your home and violate you and use violence against you, you want me to do like pre investigation? And I've been shown many times in this building. Is and I've been all over here. Huh? Is it on law? What? Your car? I don't know if my car is on right now. Where's sure your ID going to be at? It'll be, uh, yeah, if you're looking at my, in my, on my dash, my CV, it should be right next to the CV. If it's not on me right here or in my room right now. No, no. Hey, sir, you can come out just back over here. I'm working right to the car real easy. That gonna hurt you if you do? No. I, 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 have, I have no problems with you showing how things. I have no more. Yeah, you know, I'm you got it. I'm a, I, I'm, right now, you just worked in that in my house right here, man. I know, I understand. We, we've not been told. We've been told that's a patrol before. <laughs> Even if it's not technically his house and he does not have permission to be there, you definitely don't have any real legitimate reason to be there, especially inside. So you don't have a key to your house? Mm -hmm. That door doesn't, and that, it's only where the other door where you all came in. You see where we're going with it? Yes, I understand. It's kind of unusual. You see why we're violating your rights, right? Now, this is where the part where he turns into the rapist mentality and he starts blaming his victim for his problems and his mistakes. This first time I've been out we I was looking for a little girl. So about out. a month and a half ago. Immediate cop explaining the one two punch. I was looking for a little girl and now about a month and a half ago, like right on cue. Two other officers were in there screaming, yelling, Hey, if you're in here, show hey, up. You're in that one locked room. They wouldn't come out. That wasn't me. They're like that right now for the last couple months. Same vehicle. All your stuff's in there. Were you the person that was in there? Yes. Yeah. 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 Yes, Mr. Sample, I'm going to try this here. I'm saying it's hard telling what I'm doing. Well, we're well, going to go here. Not all the time. 19 until the tape. Father's come down and he. Orly is fat. Father's come down and he. Sorry, wife called. And get me up and we're doing stuff. I got to get Orly is fat as we've done. I can afford to lie. Do you want a Georgia DO for me? Yes, sir. Like I said, I had my phone until this officer uh, got a little aggressive. I was going to prove that stuff, so. Zero five five one six one four two zero. You do what he or she tells you to do. Oh, because you wanted to play games and you didn't bow down and deep throat my whole boot, and you actually went by the law and your constitutional rights that I swore to defend. That's why we had a problem, because you exercised the rights that I swore to defend, and and that's always a problem with police officers for some reason. It's like he had a right to privacy in his home. It's like he had the right to privacy in his papers. I guess this captain forgot the whole Constitution and his oath he took. It's a, it's a shame. Again, it's not a few bad apples. The, the most rotten apples are at the top of the chain. Top of the food chain, the captain. Forget the law. Forget his rights. When a cop tells you something, you do it. That's the law. One, four, uh, police officer two, zero. You do what he or she tells you to do. Okay. We've been told oh, that you've got your opinion, out. and I'll just handle it later on a different way. Okay. So. All right. Can we get somebody on the computer to find out who this is owned by right now? Because at the point it was going to be sold and refurbished. They, they bought it over. What does that matter who it's owned by? Do you have reason to suspect that he doesn't ha uh, allow to be there? Would you even know he was there if you didn't go in without a warrant? Again, Always escalating, and he doesn't stop till the very end. Here go. Do you have his number offhand? Is there anybody at the, uh, in the office that can TLO? Do you have his number offhand so we can call him? Let's, let's quit playing that game. Didn't he offer to call him for you and offer you all the permission and all the paperwork to prove that he was allowed to be there? You're the only one playing games. I'm going to go get his phone. Yeah, well. Yes, 
He already informed you, and now listen to what this disgusting pig's about to say. I'm pretty sure he knows now that if the monster ever passed for his ID, he's damn sure better get it. Really? What law is that there, uh, Captain Piglet? That if the monster ever passed for his ID, he's damn sure better get it. All right. Thank you. Bye. All right. Well, now we're straight. Oh, you think that's over? No, this this captain is still butt hurt because he's breaking the law, broke the law from start to finish, still breaking the law, falsely imprisoning this guy for doing nothing wrong, used force against him. But that's not enough. Now he's going to try to still go after the guy. I guess I've turned it off. Well, we didn't get dog bit. So they're not arrested for resisting, refusing to give his eye. Well, we didn't get dog bit, so if his dog would have bit us, we would have murdered the dog and possibly him. So at least we're good there. But we still, you know, we still got to get either steal his money or take away his freedom. What do you think there, uh, a fellow blue coat? Yeah, okay, yes, I just let him go with a woman. What do you think? Mm. What would you like? Uh, now he's, again, this is like a... A serial killer who's got his his hostage, his his victim hostage. What would you like to happen here? You know what he would like. He would like for you to go f your mom. That's what he would like. Would you like to go to jail? Would you like to, for me to let you out of hand? Forty-one twenty-one. All right. Thank you. Warning is appropriate. Warning is appropriate. You got it. Handcuff key on. A warning is appropriate now because he didn't get smart with him right there. If he would have said the, the slightest thing sideways, they'd be like, all right, let's get some charges trumped up on this guy. No, that there's no, no door to lock there. I don't care what's I used to, I used to, I used to. It was locked last yeah. time I was here. I was saying, most of it should be unlocked. The only one, like I said, you pressed that one down. The, the one by the laundry room, it's the only one that's really easy to get into. No, not this one, the one around the corner. So, like I said, about a month and a half ago, I was looking for a missing girl. Yeah, they're looking for a missing girl, just like Billy Butt Crack. The building back up to modern code after hurricane, it was going to cost us. And they were like, no, they get rid of it, they sold it. And this guy is planning on putting uh, apartment complexes in it. Right now it's in the government, you know, and the city council. Yeah, a lot of this stuff is so old, that's why Now the captain does a driver shame, doesn't say sorry, sorry miscommunication, sorry for using violence against you, but again, it's your fault you didn't bow down to my uh, unlawful whims. So you're the bad guy, person who was... Served his country, sleeping, not bothering anybody, trying to get some rest in his own home in with some privacy without being harassed by the government with no warrant. I guess he's the bad guy here, right? I guess he's done. I guess he's done. So, yeah. One, nine, six, 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 ten, eight. Actually, can I get some information from you? Ten, eight. Yeah. Uh, one, nine, six. Do you want us to close this call? Ciccarelli and Sergeant Thor still 10-12 speaking with him, but you can close it out. No action taken. An incident number. And it's a, and the name, name and badge number is the way everyone was just here. There's no report for it to be done. But doesn't mean to be. I was just putting handcuffs. Oh, no report, even though there was use of force? Oh, interesting. That's how they were going to handle this. If this guy didn't stop and ask for names and report and this information, they would have just went on about their corrupt blue coat lives but now he's going to press the issue and good for him he deserves it so there's not going to be no report made here no, 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 body can't be going the whole time mm -hmm. of course it is I know my legal rights on certain things and I do believe even what he said was wrong so okay. yeah it was 100% wrong is Officer Ciccarelli, CI, CC, CI, CC, CC, ARE, ARE, LLI, LLI, badge number 219. 
through 19. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you know, yeah, if it comes down to investigating, there's nothing wrong. Y'all were, you know, that's part of, part of your policy, then that's how it be. But I don't, I don't believe that, so. Had to be thrown in handcuffs the way I was thrown in handcuffs, and hopefully that video will come out and show how, how he rested he was, so. In my own spot after I just got woken up, you saw it. I was just woken up from things, trying to explain things, and I'm st- worried about my dog attacking people and this and that, you know. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a vet. They just had things, so. L-A-R. L-A-R. M-O-R-E. M-A-R-A-M. O-R-E. Okay, sorry. My, I'm, 196 is his badge number. That's the captain. Okay, you the captain. Okay, your name, sir? I am Thor. C-H-O-R-P. That's the interesting name. And badge number? 1711. Sergeant. Sergeant. Okay. Thank you. Anyway, you get the gist of this. Thanks for watching. Peace, tranquility. Subscribe to Anthony X. Much love. Tortilla chips with tuna. See ya.